Next up tonight, you can't even see it because it's too tall. There it is. Turn it sideways. 2013-14 Panini Contenders Hockey. I've never seen a product more loaded in my lifetime. In my whole life, let's go over the teams. Alan G has the Maple Leafs. Dale T with the Red Wings. David M with the Capitals. Dylan's got the Senators. Oh, sorry, there's two Dylans. Dylan D with the Senators. Dylan S with the Ducks. Jason S. Predators. John L with the Jets. Joseph K has the Canucks. Josh Y with the Hurricanes. Justin S. Wild and Devils. Nathan A with the Blue Jackets. Nathan R with the Sabres. Paul B has Avalanche and Canadiens. The Flax Man with the Blackhawks. Scott A with the Islanders. Sean P with the Coyotes. Stephen H. Oilers and Kings. Thomas S. Penguins. Tim S. Bruins, Flames, Stars, Panthers, Flyers, Sharks, Lightning. And Tim V has Rangers and Blues. Loaded, but too much base. Yeah, that's... I would agree with that. Are we breaking Friday? Um, no, we're not breaking Friday. I'm going to take a rare Friday off. I don't think I've... Man, have I ever taken a Friday off? Um... It's 4th of July. You guys are all going to be doing stuff with the family. I'm not going to... Maybe not all of you, but I know a lot of people are going to be doing family stuff. We'll just take it off. And then Saturday is a... I got a family event going on too, so... We'll just keep it... Keep it a nice short holiday week. A lot of people are going to be gone, so... I won't worry about it. Alright. Let's see how fast I can do this one. Why does that look sideways? It's weird. Looks like it's falling over, doesn't it? All right. <clears throat> Gabrick to a hundred. Spacer base. Max Reinhardt for the Flames. Rookie ticket. Yeah, tomorrow is two five casers. Alexander Steen to nine uh four ninety nine. So there's two five casers tomorrow. There's Bowman Inception five caser by player. You can buy your player, and every card we hit for your player, you get out of five cases. There's some really good deals. There's a lot of twenty dollar prospects. So if there's a prospect that you like for twenty bucks, you know, every card out of five cases, you might get a bunch of colored parallels of a guy. Uh, Roman Yossi to four ninety nine. Base, 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 base. Ooh, here's a fat pack, though. RPA. Jared Stahl, 23 of 100. These are so nice. Look at that thing. I think these are going to be quite collectible. There's only 100 of them, and they're beautiful for each player. At least the base, you know, the 100 version. Man, I forgot to do World Cup this week. What was I thinking? Uh, Eunice Rask for the Predators. Rookie ticket. You lied to me. I have a turn in the back of my head now. Sorry. Paul Stastny. Four ninety-nine. Too many base packs, you're right. It's not even rookies, you know. The base is all veterans. It's really like no need for all that really. Oh, redemption. Oops. NHL Inc. Joe Colborn. Yeah, that's right. We do have tomorrow still, so I'm going to do the... I have UFC for tomorrow. I can do the triple threads tomorrow. We can make tomorrow into a... a massive Thursday night before the holiday weekend. Actually, I might move the breaks up 
depends on um, some stuff, but thinking about moving the brakes up in time. Box two. To four ninety nine, Sidney Crosby. Riley Smith, 6 of 25, NHL Inc. Nice parallel. Slap of the base. Where'd Huds go? Uh, Vienza Contenders, number to 499. Varlamov. Another redemption. Tarasenko, rookie ticket signatures variation. Tim, Vladimir Tarasenko for the Blues, the variation parallel. 24 hours a day. Yeah, let me just break 24 hours a day. I'll just never ship anything. Henrik Lundqvist autograph? Whoa! Look at that. That's awesome. Look at that card. 21 of 25, Lundqvist, Lundqvist rookie ticket auto. That's awesome. <clears throat> Heck are the Rangers? I can't even find them on here. It does look clean, I know. Where can I find the Rangers? Tim! That's for my staff, yeah. I should make my staff do everything else, huh? For the Sharks, oh, Tomas Hurdle, rookie ticket. There you go, Tim. Nice one. My staff. Janine Melnitz from my staff. Legacies, Wendell Clark. Fly Rasmus out. To a hundred. Le Cavalier. Le Cavalier. I don't know how that happened. Oops. What's wrong with the use team stream? Jordan Schwartz soars to 600. Base, the base, base, base. This is not base. For the Sabres, Conacher, Rudwell, I don't know how to say that guy's name, Zadaroff and Tardif. Claude Otto, Nathan R. There you go, Nathan. One quad down. There's usually about eight a case. Oh, oh. Spacer. Mike Smith. Vienza contenders. Rookie ticket, Corey Conacher. Auto Senators.
I didn't even think about the variations on the rookie tickets with the stars on the back. It's the same as normal contenders where the stars are not there on the back if it's a parallel. Lemieux to four ninety nine. There's a to 100 Jordan Schwarz again. Schwarz. Oh. Tom Wilson, RPA. 68 of 100, the gold ink. Is that the one you were calling out? Oh, bottom right. No, doesn't look that. Spacer. For the Kings, Martin Jones, rookie ticket. All of them have stars on the back so far, so it doesn't look like they're, they have any variations, if that's what variation does. Yeah, the gold ink blacks are great, huh? 4.99, Ryan Murray. Now the box bites the dust. This would be perfect with like half the packs. <clears throat> Man, I can't wait for the World Cup Friday. The Friday games are going to be awesome. Isn't it like Germany and France on Friday and then Colombia, Brazil or something? It's going to be so good. Uh, Zach Sill, 600. There's another one. Magnus Helberg for the Predators to 100. Uh, time again for the Flyers. Rookie ticket. For Tim. Yeah, Colombia, Brazil. Can't wait for that game. That dude from Colombia is a stud. And then there's some guys from Brazil that I heard are pretty good too. Tyler Pitlick, one of the better names of the class. Maybe the best name of the class. I have one more case of soccer. Brian Gibbons. I have one more case of Prism World Cup. I meant to do it this week, but... Just haven't had time. Four ninety nine Iserman. Uh, Ryan Stanton, NHL Inc. Canucks. I'm getting my Xbox One this weekend and I'm getting FIFA. I don't care. Carey Price. Time. I don't know why I don't have an Xbox One. Well, probably because there's no games to play. But it's getting serious now. Oi. Drop the pack. You're so slimy. I hear such mixed reviews on Titanfall. It's like some people say it's the worst. Other people say it's amazing. It's I've never heard more different reviews on a game. Everyone calls it Titan Fail. To 600, Nate Schmidt. Watchdogs. <laughs> yeah, Titanfall. Uh, to 600, Carl Stollery. 
Watch Dogs. You been playing that, Drew? Frank Carrado for the Canucks. Rookie auto. Frank Carrado, rookie auto. Here we go. I love this card. Brett Ballmer, NHL Inc. I love the landscape version. I'm playing right now. Uh, Nicholas Cronwall. See, I was going to get a PS4 and play MLB The Show, but I already bought it for PS3, thinking it wasn't even worth getting a PS4 for it. It looked exactly the same. The graphics were, like, slightly better. And there's no backwards compatibility or whatever, so... Although I think you can load your character from... Isn't it true you can load your character from... You know... Any version of the show 14 into any other version, I think. Ovechkin to four ninety nine. Here we go. We got that. Is this that one we had before? It's got two lightning. Yeah, two lightning, two hurricanes, and two panthers. Drew Shore, Barkov, Jared Stahl, uh, Tyler Johnson, Palat, and Lindstrom. So this time we got lightning is Tim. Hurricanes, Josh. Florida Panthers, Tim. Okay, this card goes to Tim. He's our, he has two of the three teams. Start, sorry, Josh. Yeah, the reason the reason um, I'm getting the Xbox is because the Halo is coming out in November or December. That's going to be I, I would buy a, a new Xbox just for that. Reto Berra, I love love me some Halo. Halo One, Halo Two, Halo Three. <clears throat> Start doing hockey, everyone falls asleep. Paul Stastny. Just don't need to start getting some more loaded hits. Where are they? Uh, Hickey for the Islanders. <laughs> Excuse me. We've got Pitlick and Hickey. Sounds like a sounds like a typical <laughs> sounds like a typical weekend for Jules in high school. Drew, don't even talk to me about that. Drew, we're now brothers. Now that you just said that, we're on a new level of of. Of kinship. Me and you are now brothers. That's what I did in college. At my apartment in college, I was like the only person in the whole city who was doing that. Mike Smith, playbook autograph, 80 of 99 for the Coyotes. I had four different TVs, two upstairs and two downstairs. Four Xboxes on a LAN, a LAN line that went to a little switch. It was the funnest time of my entire life. It will never get better than that. Camilleri. Nothing in my life has ever been even remotely as fun as when I was in college playing Halo with 16 people in my house. Christopher Breen. This is what would happen. Oh, a duck squad. Adam Van Vatanen, sorry. Campus Lindholm and John Gibson quad for the Ducks. Dylan. This is what would happen. We would go out. Kevin Pitt Snoggle? He was your neighbor? Oh, that is so weird. 
How could someone forget Pit Snuggle? Best name ever. To a hundred. Anyways, Blackhawks, Kostka, rookie ticket. It would be like a Saturday night. We would get a bunch of beer, a bunch of pizza, start at like, I don't know, 8 or 9 p.m. when everyone got off work. People, different people got off work. A lot of, I had a lot of restaurant friends. I used to bartend. And uh, we would play till like 4 a.m. And it was the funnest thing in the world. Never had more fun in my entire life. There were some nights where, <laughs> like, some of my friends were in the upstairs and, you know, on the other team, and they were so mad. Like, we would crush, you know, everyone. I don't know. Sometimes we would get beat. Sometimes the other team would get beat. But this one night, I don't know what it was, but the team I was on was just dominating the other team. And, like, they were upstairs. You know, they couldn't see us. They were upstairs and we were downstairs. After the games were over and we quit, they couldn't even look at us. When they were walking down the stairs, they like wouldn't even talk to us because they were so frustrated. It was the best. <laughs> That's exactly what I did. People, my friends still text me every once in a while like, dude, Halo 1. There's never be a better, we'll never have more fun than that. Pessinen for the devils. Kids nowadays, they don't understand. Matthew Conan for the Flyers rookie ticket. The map that I remember, dude, hang them high. Oh, Owen Nolan for the Sharks autograph. Drew, hang them high. Hang them high was like the most, that was the most contested and ep heat, most heated battles on hang them high. That little room with the windows, you know, that, that overlooks the the middle or whatever. Everyone would always get in there and like try to hold that room. Kevin Deneen for the Whalers. I actually think Halo 2 was a better game. Halo 2 might be the best Halo ever. Halo 1 was just, yeah, it was just, I don't know, it's hard to explain. Born Evolve for the Canadians. Yeah. The other map that used to make people want to kill each other is the, I can't remember it, the name of it, but there's like a, it's a really small map. In the very middle, there's a platform, like a raised platform. And then I think there's like four, four little uh, side areas around that. And you have to like walk up the ramp and jump from one of those to the middle, the middle raised platform with like a pillar around the middle. Jaden Schwartz, NHL Inc. for the Blues. You know what I'm talking about, right, Drew? Combat Evolved. Sorry, Halo Combat Evolved. Uh, Marshall Salt, whatever his name is. Anyway, that one. We would play Invisible Shotguns. Invisible Shotguns on that map best thing ever. Seth Jones to 499. Actually, King of the Hill Invisible Shotguns. King of the Hill. Michael Grabner. One minute to win. <laughs> Let's do it. No, I hate midship. Freaking hate midship. That's the worst map. Any map with alien guns sucks. That's pretty much the, the rule of thumb on Halo. If the default weapons are alien guns, it's probably not a good map. Uh, Lata to 100, rookie ticket. What the heck was the name of that map? What's the name of that map? Getzloff to 499. <laughs> 
Ah ouais. Everyone starts on the ground when that map starts. And you you right away you walk over. It's like a stone room. Everything's kind of like stone colored. The needler, man. Screw the needler. I hate alien weapons. Huberdo. First drafts auto. Lord of Panthers, there you go. Tim. Nah. Alien weapons are weak. The alien sniper. The alien sniper is uh, the only one that's kind of cool. Here's a duel. Kadri and Turris, Senators and Maple Leafs. Dual auto. Dylan D and Alan G. So we gotta we gotta find an order for that after the break. Anyway, you start out on the ground. It's a stone colored, like a gray colored map. Everything's kind of gray colored. First thing you do is run to a ramp that goes up to these side things, and then you walk up on that and then jump into this middle area. The beam rifle, dude. That's the only good weapon for the alien stuff. Gergensen's for the sabers. Friggin' needler. I hate the needler. Being killed by the needler is one of the most annoying things. It's all about the pistol, anyway. Grant Fuhr. That's the only thing I didn't like about... the When the Halos kept going, they kind of lost the... The battle rifle got worse and worse. And the pistol became useless. Ovechkin. Oh, I thought it was numbered. No. Plasma pistol melee. Oh, yeah. You charge the thing up. To four ninety nine. Halak. Energy sword. Chad Billens to six hundred. Energy sword. When I think of the energy sword, I think of Halo Two. With that map on the beach where there's the warthog out on the beach and there's that wall. The seawall, remember that? Man, that map rules. Okay, I need to play Halo 2 right now. How do I play Halo 2 right now? Does it even work anymore? Can you, you can't even play it online anymore, huh? They shut all the servers down. Oh, I can't wait. Cannot wait. Zanzibar, there you go. I'm not gonna make it, but I'll order it from Zanzibar. Zanzibar, so good. Four ninety nine, Phil Kessel. Uh, Zizernuski, the Senators to six hundred. November eleventh. Oh, that's not that far away. Colin Wilson, I will play all you dudes. We will play Halo. On the Xbox, we'll have a. We should have a CSB, like clan or something. That would be awesome. Drew, you're captain. Captain of the CSB. Halo crew. Start recruiting. We'll get our butts kicked every night. It'll be great. Now I have some friends that are pretty good still. One really good friend that plays all the time still. So. Kevin Miller is 600. He'll help. Look at me and Drew. We, Drew and I could not be more on the same page about everything in life. Drew, we might be twins. Maybe we're separated at birth. Junus Rask. The Predators. <laughs> Swimwear. Gosh. Freaking Halo. I don't think people understand about Halo. You just don't understand unless you were there. Koivu for the wild. Four ninety nine. Norse contenders. Another great map. I think it was Halo Two. Man, how do I explain this one? 
Eric will probably know. You guys can look it up. How do I explain this map? Oh. Victor Fathsh to 100. That's a sweet patch, too. Fathsh. Anaheim Ducks. You remember that map? Where you start out and you walk down, there's like a little waterfall in the rocks. And the sh the uh, rocket launcher is right there behind that waterfall. That should give it away right there. And then be if you backed up at the beginning, there's an elevator that goes up and down. And there's kind of these ramps that wind around on the sides. And there's an air vent that pops you up on one of the sides. Tyler Johnson for the lightning. That map was so fun. The sword is down on the bottom where there's another like pool of water. Waterfall thing. Yeah, that one is so good. That's that's why Halo 2 is so amazing because Oh, that's a fat boy. That's a let's just get to this booklet right now. <laughs> Ryan take over. Alright, bunch of base cards. Number to ninety-nine. Ducks and Predators. Frederick Anderson, Victor Fathes, Magnus Helberg, and Merrick Mazanik. Quad Auto Booklet. Ivory Tower. Is that what it's called? Yeah, that sounds right. Dylan S. and... Uh, Dylan S. Jason S. Ivory Tower. Epic map. God, it's like I'm it's like yesterday. I can just see myself playing that map. Can't you just walk through that whole map right now in your mind? <laughs> Johan Gustafsson for the wild rookie ticket auto. Oh, you got the wrong team. David Bax. Keith Yandel, four ninety nine. Matt Duchesne to a hundred. Do they have championship tickets? We need a championship ticket. Yeah, I know. I'm the same way. I'm surprised we haven't gotten into a WoW talk yet. I won't even do that on camera. Everyone will leave. We don't even need to start talking about WoW. Petrangelo. I need to look at some Halo 2 maps. Oh, another great Halo 2 map. The Halo 2 map with that sundial in the middle that rotates. That's a good one. <laughs> uh, to 600, Sami Atokalio, whatever. I don't know. Golden Knight. Uh... Oh, ooh. Nathan McKinnon, John Sebastian Jaguer, Calvin Picard, and Michael Scarbasa. Quad auto. Look at that, Paul B. Another McKinnon autograph for Paul B. You're almost guaranteed a McKinnon autograph in these cases. <laughs> Secret glitch jumps. Yeah. Which Mario Kart? Ryan Murray for the Blue Jackets rookie ticket. Mario Kart on 64. Four boxes left, by the way. Three on one. Proximity mine. <laughs> 64, yeah. That's the last one I really played. Vienza Contenders, four ninety nine. Man, where's my sixty four? I need to bust that thing out. Sixty four, greatest system of all time. 
Can't beat it. PS3 could not even, or PS2 and PS1 could not even hold a candle to 64 for me back in the day. I had no interest in PlayStation. Dzeranuski to 600. Hari Pessinen, the Devils. Contenders forever. Adam Foot. Avalanche autograph. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Get ready, Drew. Trevor Linden. Have a good night. We're going to do it. It's going to happen. Steve Oleski. Capitals, rookie ticket auto. What's up, Blake? Andrej Palat, NHL Inc. for the Lightning. What was it that guy called me? Remember that? Card Smith, is that what it was? Uh, Christopher Breen to 100. I just, I just reminded me of something. What was that, Jules? It was like, hey, guy, or something. Did he call me guy? Oliver Lardison. Lardison. Flyers? <laughs> Halo team tryouts. For the Jets, Edward Pasquale. It's been really, really good in the chat lately. We haven't had any troublemakers for a while, knock on wood. Smith guy. That's what it was. Chris Terry. NHL Inc. The Canes. God. We had a run there where we just had people, annoying people, one after another. Kevin Deneen. The Whalers. But Hartford, the Whale? A land party. <clears throat> If we're going to have a LAN party, we're going to play Battlefield 1942. That is my original LAN party game. Dude, Battlefield 42. If you weren't there at that time, I remember I remember seeing the demo for that game. And I saw a guy like run up to a, a tank and just blow up the tank. And then run over to an airplane and start flying an airplane. It was epic. You don't understand, like before that game, Martin C. Martin St. Louis. You couldn't just run up into a helicopter and fly it off and then like get out of a helicopter and get into a tank and then blow up something and then get out of that and shoot people. Like you just couldn't even do that. <laughs> when that game came out, it was like, it was revolutionary. Tyler Toffoli, NHL Inc. Auto. Christian Thomas, for the Canadians. What do you mean, Terry? Oh, Unreal Tournament. Uh, that was pretty good. I didn't play a lot of that, but I, I definitely played it. Dustin Brown to 4.99. I never played Half-Life that much at all. I mean, I played like the one-player mode, but that's about it. Battlefield was so good. You were a big troublemaker? Yeah. That's Terry. Always causing trouble. Uh, Temu Salani to four ninety nine. Oh, John Gibson, 69 of 100, gold ink patch. Uh, 
Uh, 600 Kevin Miller. John Jonathan Realt for the Panthers. Matt Duchesne to four ninety nine. I got worms. Iserman to four ninety nine. That's what we're gonna call it. So much base. Way too much base. Tony Twist? Jules, there's actually a guy named Tony Twist on the blues, or was, I mean. I would have been the hugest Tony Twist fan. Tony Twist. How have I never heard that name before? Uh, Tory Krug to four ninety nine, and Lyndon Vay to six hundred. He was a bruiser. I don't remember him. Of course, I wasn't watching hockey until the last maybe 10 years. Bobby Ryan, NHL Inc. Auto. Ottawa. Did he twist the knife? Panic for the Lightning. Rookie ticket. <clears throat> Pavlicek fiends of contenders. Pavlik, sorry, Pavlicek. I'm thinking of Pavlicek. Tim, what are the sharks doing in the free agency? Oh, another McKinnon. That's the same card again. Cardigan. <laughs> Pull over. Same exact card for Paul B. Another McKinnon quad with Jaguar, Picard, and Scarbasa. Good golly. Antiranta, 600. The Sharks made any deals yet? I haven't seen anything. Cut anybody? Sign anybody? I heard a lot of. A lot of hockey moves are going on right now. Put on some sweet hockey moves. Uh, Sean Lalonde. Lalonde. The Blackhawks. Last box. Five million years later. Not a quick break, contenders. There's a lot in it, but there's a lot of base. A lot of watching base. I haven't done anything yet. Andrej, I don't know how to say this dude's name. Sister, need some vowels in there, homie. Two of Edge, oh no, different players. Sidney Crosby to four ninety nine. Sustra. Sustra. Jeez. It's impossible. You can't know the name unless you actually hear it. Oy. First drafts. Elias Lindholm for the Hurricanes. 
Yeah, I'm gonna go play some hockey. I only had one goal this weekend. One goal and one assist this weekend. Ryan Strom for the Islanders rookie ticket. It was the worst goal I've ever scored. It was a joke. I hit the puck about as hard as a two-year-old would hit a puck. It just happened to... I was in front of the net, on the left side of the net, you know? I'm left-handed, so my backhand... <coughs> I was kind of backhanded toward the net. And someone shot the puck at the goalie, and it kind of bounced off, and I just kind of swiped it backhanded into the left side of the bottom of the net, where the goalie was, like, totally to the right-hand side. It was the easiest... I mean, it was kind of hard to backhand it in for me, but it was the slowest, softest shot I've ever <laughs> scored on. That was so dumb. Here's another six autograph. Oh, this is like all different teams. Patrick Kane, Dustin Brown, Ryan Monahan. No, Ryan McDonough, sorry. Jonathan Taves, Corey Perry, and Jay Bomeister. Dang, that's a good one. Look at that. Jonathan Taves, Robert F., Corey Perry for Dylan, Jay Bomeister for Tim V., uh, Patrick Kane again, so there's two Blackhawks, wait, yeah, Taves and Kane, two Blackhawks, Dustin Browns at Kings for Stephen H., and Ryan McDonough. Tim V's Rangers. So that still has to go to random. Nobody owns a majority of the card. But you'll get, you know, your name in extra times for having two teams. That was a nice, a nice six auto card. Chris Terry to 600. Charney for the Canadians. Sulky contenders. And the last pack of the break. Reto Berra. Calgary Flames. Only six teams left in Inception 30. You guys could fill that. You don't want to end the night now, do you? One more Inception before tomorrow. Whoa, I got packs everywhere. Yeah, definitely going to do a hit recap. Um, first, let me... Well, first let me find the owners of those cards. One sec. Mm, okay. Hold on, base dump. Thanks, Big Flax. Make sure I didn't leave any autos in the parallels pile. Okay. Actually, only three cards to random. That's not bad. <clears throat> 